one of the medical leaders at the Institute for Medizinische Diagnostik in Berlin. The IMD was found in 1994 and has grown continuously since this time. We perform at IMD more than 3,000 different analysts. Every day we analyze about 20,000 blood probes from about 8,000 patients. I am uh, Andrea Thiem. I am the leader of the microbiome uh, laboratory in IMD, Institute for Medical Diagnostics in Berlin, in Germany. We started a new laboratory in the last year for give the doctors a chance to do the di diagnostics for microbiome and some biochemical markers. Our whole laboratory is a big laboratory in Berlin and we have a part of it as a special immunology for the doctors who want to work in a holistic way and we offer them tests and analyzes in immunology and for micronutrients, for metal toxicology, for genetic testing and many other tests. But the only thing uh, what was, was still missing was the microbiome test. My name is Christiane Kupsch. I'm head of the molecular diagnostic part of the microbiome lab at IMD Berlin. We use the GMAP technology to analyze gut bacteria, which we cannot grow in culture because they have an anaerobic metabolism. And um, we can get insights into the number and identity of these bacteria using the GMAP test. Among them are, for example, butyrate-producing bacteria. Butyrate is a short-chain fatty acid, which is essential to um, provide energy for the epithelial gut cells and has many other important functions. Also, we can detect, for example, mucosa-protective bacteria, which are really important to maintain an intact gut barrier. Um, in the test, we have 48 different probes, um, which are specific for certain bacteria species or groups of bacteria. So altogether, we can detect more than 300 different species. And um, this, so this needs a very high level of multiplexing to do this kind of analysis. And um, this is enabled by the Luminex XMAP technology. So here we have a bead set with 100 differently labeled beads. And each of the bead colors is linked to one of our specific probes. And in that way, we can simultaneously detect all the species in a single run and quite quickly. The results from a Luminex run is analyzed with a GMAP analyzer software. And um, this is a um, software with a validated algorithm standing behind it. And it can tell, tell us, um, is there bacterial dysbiosis? Do we have reduced bacterial di diversity? Or have we enough bacteria, um, uh, bacteria which produce butyrate?